is amazing. So I was hijacked. Nana Giri hacked. I don't mean to make you sound old, but I, I used to listen to him go radio bar. Oh, he's going to do the first hour, uh, part one. And then after that, to uh, title selfies and what what, and then we'll come back for round two. All right. Oh, boys! <laughs> Sammy Jacobs, James. Hey, give me a big hand. On drums, our neighbor from Mums. The guys are now on pension, the two guys. Sasa guys. <laughs>
back in 1972. I was born. Cho, 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 cho. No, I ever been. <laughs> Go get it. And look, tonight is nothing about new music, it's nothing about what the new kids are listening to, it's about the good music, the timeless music, the classics on top of classics. Now, speaking of timeless, can we please note how beautiful our people look tonight? Now, I have a few questions, but before I get there, I'd like to ask, could you please introduce yourselves? Sandil MCB. Sandil MCB. Nice to meet you both. Now, tonight we're in the presence of a legend who gave us a personal, intimate experience into his new passion album. How would you guys rate tonight's experience? It was beautiful. It was superb. We love dance music. It keeps us going. It was very nice. Look, I wouldn't have said it better myself, but the ultimate lot, Don Lara made sure that we had ourselves a great experience. So, for people who haven't been introduced to the music before, what would you say to them? Jazz is not about all people. Jazz is for all. And quiet jazz is the way to go. Would you like to add on it? No, 
Uh, he, he has all said it. Uh, jazz is very nice. Uh, it's all for all people. Look, you had it here first with NRTV and NRL Studios. Je Why jazz is not just for the old, it's for people who appreciate timeless music. Thank you so much for your time and may you guys enjoy the rest of your night. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are in the presence of a living legend, an iconic piece of South African history, the ultimate Don Lara. How are you feeling, sir, tonight? Very excited. Um, like it's the first time I'm actually on stage. <laughs> After 47 years, yeah. Look, I think it translated in the performance as well. I was captivated from when you gave me passion all the way to Izulu, all the way to right to the end. Okay. So I think the question is, how do you keep it so consistent over the years? Passion. Passion. Ladies and gentlemen, if you didn't get it, I think now you get it. So a lot of people have the misconception that jazz is for one would say the mature crowd and look I'm not mature at all and I had myself a great time so yeah. what how do you feel about people thinking that jazz is just for the mature, mature crowd well, well I think it's a misconception as you say because the history of jazz every top musician we know from Charlie Parker Miles Davis and all them when they made their names do you know they were all teenagers people don't know Charlie Parker died at the age of 32 very young most of them, Coltrane was 40. So most of the top jazz musicians never reached 40, by the way. So people, the misconception, just because the art has been there for such a long time, it shows that it's longevity. No, that is true. Jazz is one of the most consistent forms of art that I have come to, in contact with and to have. I think, I think the thing is, it's such a mature sound and it's a sound that is renowned and leads people to be in a calm state of mind and that's why they may they may take it to be something for the mature crowd but what you gave us tonight was something new vibey it's groovy i was my feet it's were tapping the whole time that, that's the reason why this music i call it quiet jazz because it's, it's, it's a mixture of quiet though and and the way quiet comes from the the cape the, the, the cape town sound that you know of, of quiet means happy uh, hip Look, I, 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 as, a, as, a, as a music connoisseur myself, I am happy to be in the presence of a legend. For everyone that is at home and that has not heard your music as to yet, I suggest they start straight from Passion by a pun. So when can they get it? Where can they get it? Let them know. P Passion is coming out next week and all the music that we perform is available. They can get it and stream it on all the platforms. Yeah, platforms. Yeah. See, it's not just for the mature crowd. You can even get it on these new digital platforms as well. Yes. Go to the stores, get them. So, Don Lara, thank you so much for your time. I cannot wait to get passion. I need to get it because what these, what these new people are releasing now needs to move over because the ultimate Don Lara is coming with that classical sound, man. Thank, thank you, you so much, much for your time. Thank you for thank the performance. Thanks for enjoying the music also. Thank no, thank you. you so much. NR Studios, NR TV, Don Lara in the building. Thank you so much. Look, in our studios, in our TV, we're still situated at the busiest, most happening Imbizo in Africa as we speak right now, Imbizo Shisanyama. And I am joined by a beautiful lady. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Tana Zomnis. I'm from Pretoria. Nice to meet you, Tana Zomnis. Now, I'd like for you to explain to us the experience tonight, from the food, to the music, to the people, to the service. How was it? Okay, starting from the food, wow, I love it. <laughs> okay, they gave us great meat. I love meat, hey? Okay, and from the service, it was a nice service. I really enjoyed. I got everything I wanted, and the people around, wow. They're beautiful people, beautiful soul around me, yeah. <laughs> no, this is sounding to be such a nice time. Now, let's focus more on the music and the experience itself. How do you feel Mr. John Lager's performance was? Did you enjoy it? Was it something that you were usually used to or was it a new experience? Oh, wow. Well, um, <clears throat> since I'm a theatre practitioner, I know this kind of music. It was very nice. It was, wow. I can't even explain. It was very nice. I enjoyed everything. Look, I am really glad to hear that you had yourself a nice night and it was a great experience. Now, for people who don't know where to catch you, do you have an Instagram handle perhaps where they can follow you or where we can tag you on the video? No, so far I don't. <laughs> so far I don't. But then, yeah, so far I don't. Look, you heard it here first, NRTV, Imbizo Shisanyama, Don Laga's album launch, Passion is the name of the game. Thank you so much.
So look, we are still at Mbizo Shisanyama for Don Lara's album launch. And look, when I'm speaking about standing next to legends, this is one of them. We got the one and only Opa boys, Makube, like with us right now. So how are you feeling after such a hot performance? Ah, I feel great. Really, really? Very, very, very great. Yeah. Look, most of the time people focus on so many different things, but me, I was on the guitar. How long have you been playing the guitar? Why is it such a big passion for you? Ah, I've been playing the guitar since I was three. Very Three. Long, yeah. Look, and that is. I've, I've, and I've been playing professional since from early 80s. That is almost what? 30, 40 years 40, in the game. 40 something years. Look, that is that is monumental. And yeah. what 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 has people wondering most of the time is how do you keep it going? How does the consistency stay as it is? Ah, uh, just flow with the uh, just flow with the with the with the life. I flow with life because I play everything. I play R and B, I play pop, I play jazz, and I've got my music on the yeah. side as well. Yes, yeah. and I've been performing all over the world. Look, with all the genres that you've mentioned for me, which ones are one of your favorites? My favorite is everything. You know, as a musician, you that know, is true. I listen to everything because I don't have specific favorite mm. but my favorite is my songs my music my composition your 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 own piece my of own art music yes no when it comes to your music do you think it differs from when you support another artist or is it somewhat the same i play the same it's just good music that's good music because, so, because me, i've been playing with Don Laga for a long time ah. and then we play similar so it, one could almost say that you have a synchronized energy that makes sure good all the time. It's almost like you're playing as one person. Yes. So with 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 so much going on in the music industry right now, Mukwai Jazz being not to say a new baby in the scene, but something that is somewhat different. Do you feel that there is enough power, or you guys can generate enough power to change everything? No, it's it's, a, it's got a, that power because people they must start listening to chess. They yes. mustn't go, you know people they listen to one side of the music. Mm. Like DJs, when you listen to the radios, they play the same side. old things. Mm. They don't play that other people music that they love. No, that is With true. Most so of the people they love chess. I'm a fan of jazz from yeah. after tonight, so I think I completely agree with you when you say Kwai Jazz is going to come with a new wave and it's going to open up the industry for more people. Yeah, that's true. No, thank yeah. you so much, Mr. Makubela. I am honored to be in the presence of a legend and may you enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you so much. No NRTV, you heard it here first. Look, we are still situated in Bizo Shisanyama, Don Laga's album launch, and once again, we are here to share the experience. I have with me a gentleman of all gentlemen. Could you please introduce yourself, sir? My name is uh, Rui Caladrelli. Rui Caladrelli. Yeah, uh, quite have been a friend of Don for the past one about 26 years. We've met in 1993. Quite profoundly so, a gentleman from Melody. So I've been a jazz lover, I've been following jazz from his uh, magnificent album called The Destiny. Yes, sir. Profoundly so, we, we grew up listening to it and uh, I'm so glad that 26 years later, Don comes here, still launched a new album. Profoundly so, I can only say that I can wish him many more years to come many more albums to produce and the world will be his oyster thank you so much see now that is how you announce such a legend now with with having such a catalog of music how do you feel that his recent release compares to his predecessors i i i, I, I think it boils down to like don lagas caliber and integrity that he's able to resuscitate himself as a quiet jazz artist that has not been done by many other predecessors he keeps reinventing himself into redefining quiet jazz beautifully so time and time and again and within time and one can say that Brad Don is a legend absolutely legend he keeps pioneering this thing time and time and again he does it with distinction beautifully so 
one can only wish that he could live much more longer and for him to produce much more albums that we ought to live and see. Look, I don't think there's anything else left to ask. The man has laid it all on the table. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for your time, sir. And thank you for the beautiful art of jazz. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely. Quiet jazz is what we ought to inspire for as people from the township. Quiet jazz is the inspiration of any other young artist that will come after Bradon. And his mentorship and what he have done as South Africa, we are profoundly appreciative of his efforts. Thank you That's very much, sir. <laughs> you heard it here first, guys. Good. Sure, sure.